What is good with y'all, man? So the new AP update is out today. I thought it was going to be out yesterday, uh, but it actually came out today. So it's out today. And, you know, a lot of people, you know, they got a chance the way they play. Escape Artist now is, you know, 5 plus AP for every archetype. For So for a Scrambler, Escape Artist would be 9 AP. For Improviser, I'm, I guess 10. Strong Arm would probably be 10 or 11. Field General, like 10 or 11. So... It's pretty much almost unusable. I mean, if you want to, you could still run it and then one passing ability, and then that's kind of, that's really it, to be honest. Uh, basically, today, what we're going to be doing is just kind of going over what abilities am I running now on offense, and if you didn't know for defense, they also raised the limit from 14 AP to 18 AP, so you can actually add some more abilities, and they lowered a bunch of costs and some of the uh, abilities. So, basically, right now, what I'm running on offenses for my quarterback, I'm running just straight gunslinger, which is 7 AP because uh, Jalen Hurts is a scrambler. It's the most expensive one, but I don't really want to change my quarterback, so I'm just going to stick with, you know, Hurts. I'm just going to run gunslinger on him just straight like that. At least I can throw the ball. If I got to get out of the pocket, I'm just going to have to, you know, I'm going to have to use my brain a little bit because, you know, behind the line, Jalen Hurts is, instead of being 96 speed now he's like 76 speed so kind of sucks but it is what it is you know what i mean you just gotta adapt you either adapt or you just play a different game <laughs> like that's that's just what it is so uh yeah i'm using gunslinger Jalen hurst at 7 ap uh both of my tight ends i have tight end apprentice which is 2 ap for both of them so i got tight end apprentice on mike dicka and i got tight end apprentice on Charles young so that's about 4 ap right there since so it's 2 ap for both of them um, I need tight end apprentice just for my offense. I need to be able to hot route my tight ends. Because, uh, you know, you know, I, I just I have to hot route them. The way my offense works is a two tight end offense, two receivers. So they both that like those two abilities right there, like were a must have. Like before any ability, I have to have those two tight end apprentices. And then we can add other abilities, you know, accordingly, pretty much. So uh, those two are a must. Um, and then with the abilities left over, I decided... Uh, for my number one running back, because I do run the ball quite a bit, I put Bulldozer on Derrick Henry. Well, I didn't put it on him. It's just it's been on him. But yeah, I got Bulldozer on him. And then my other back, Michael Vick, which the way I use Michael Vick is anytime I'm throwing the ball, Michael Vick's on the field. Anytime I'm running the ball, Derrick Henry's on the field. So Vick is like my pass game guy. I got running back apprentice on him and Leapfrog. And a lot of people ask, why would you put backfield mismatch on him? He only gets Leapfrog for this first slot right here. Uh, in the second slot, you see he does not get Leapfrog, uh, but he does get Running Back Apprentice, so I could put those four extra hot routes on him. So I went ahead and just said, you know what, one AP left, I'll put Running Back Apprentice on him. So that's kind of how I'm running my offense right now. Um, going forward, is it going to stay like this ability-wise? I mean, honestly, I didn't have Freight Train activated this whole time. I'm going to activate that. I don't know. I'm probably going to just let my abilities rock like this. You know what I mean? Obviously, when Michael Vick comes out... Um, I think I get Gunslinger for cheaper. I think I get it for 6 AP, if I'm not mistaken. So, I mean, I might get one more AP left. Not sure really what the heck I'm going to put on. But, yeah. Um, yeah, that's pretty much how I'm running office. I mean, Escape Bars is... Unless you want to just run a straight Escape Bars by itself. But then, you know what I mean? It's going to be a lot harder to throw the ball. So, I don't know. You guys let me know how you're running your offense right now. This is kind of how I'm running mine. The offense I run, by the way, it's I run a Denver playbook, and it's called Ace Offset. That's what I run. I got a whole video going over my offense. All right, for defense, they added 18 AP. We got 18 AP now, so I'll be honest. I really only added two abilities. I added two under pressures. I added an under pressure on Javon Hargrave, and I added an under pressure on Reggie Way. Both of my D tackles. These guys are my D tackles. Under pressure. If you don't know what it is, it's basically it causes uh, under pressure and accurates. Like they don't even have to be near the quarterback, and it could cause it, and that's pretty big because you can uh, you can win some games because of that. So that is definitely a ability that I was like, you know what, I'll just throw two of those on my D tackles. What I've been running before that though, I guess it's probably easier to look at it like this. Uh, PJ Williams, my slot corner, I got acrobat on him. Cam Chancellor, I got acrobat on him. He's basically my sub linebacker. I also have out my way on him, but it's you know zero AP. Uh, Isaiah Simmons got acrobat on him. He's also sub linebacker for me. He's in the box. And then I obviously Hargrave Reggie White. We just put under pressure on him. It's two AP I think for all archetypes. So that's about four AP right there with them combined. I put on my D tackles because um you know if a quarterback's trying to step up in the pocket away from the contain, then you know he'll go right into the under pressures 
uh, under pressure and accurate switch the under pressure so yeah uh sean taylor i got acrobat and pick artist on him he's my strong safety both of my safeties both have acrobat and pick artist uh rasul douglas he just has pick artist he's one of my outside corners uh, Brian Dawkins, he's got Acrobat Pick Artist, he's my free safety, and then I got Darius Slay, who just has Pick Artist, so, basically, that's just kind of how I'm running the defense right now, uh, this, I don't think I'm ever gonna switch this up, unless I just feel like I wanna take the under pressures off, and maybe add, like, two more Acrobats, which if I'd add two more Acrobats, it would be on Douglas and Slay, but, um, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see, I think I'm gonna run with these under pressures, See how I like him. If I'm like, you know what, fuck him, then I'm probably just gonna end up putting Acrobat on Douglas and Slay. But that's pretty much how I'm running the defense uh, with the 18 AP. Still got my 52 out of 50 Eagles. And yeah, you guys let me know. What did you guys add to your defense? You know, with the uh, extra AP, with the four extra AP for the defense. And what are you doing with offense now? Because I think most people ran escape artists. I mean, obviously there's guys that like using pocket quarterbacks. They like sitting in the pocket of their own dots. You know, it's never really... Be I could do that. I've, I've done it. I do it all the time. But, you know, having that escape orders for that one play where, you know, nothing's open and you can just make a... You, you can just get away from a... Uh, getting away from a blitzer, right? A guy coming in free and just running away from him. I mean, that's huge a lot of times. Now, you know what I mean? Can't really do that anymore. So, it is what it is, but it's the game now. You know what I mean? Hopefully, next year, they make it to where there's an incentive for using, like, a mobile quarterback. Because right now, there's really no incentive for using a mobile quarterback. You basically, at this point in the game now, you kind of got to use a pocket quarterback. That's basically, like, what it is now. Pocket QBs are on top. I'm not saying make mobile quarterbacks on top. I'm just saying next year, hopefully, they make an incentive for that. Because now, you know, like, Jalen Hurts is Tom Brady. You know what I mean? So, it is what it is, though. But that's pretty much going to do it, though, boys. Like, comment, subscribe, man. And I would definitely appreciate it if you guys dropped a fall to the Twitch. The link to that is in the description. We'll be going live tonight with this brand new AP update. Uh, and seeing how it goes. But till then, man, your boy's out.